The ab wheel rollout is an anti-extension core exercise, meaning the primary goal is to use your core muscles to resist your low back from collapsing inward. Think of the rollout as a more dynamic plank. The further you move your arms out, the more of a demand that you have on your core. The main muscles targeted here are the abdominals, hip flexors, and lats. Common mistakes of the ab wheel rollout include rolling out with just the arms, which is gonna place more of the emphasis on the arms and the lats as opposed to the abs and the obliques, which you can do more of by bringing your hips in so that they're in alignment with the rest of your body. Flexing your hips too soon on the return will do something similar to where you'll have stress on the abs and obliques on the way out, but coming back in, you'll place a lot of demand off of them and onto your hip flexors. Excessively arching your low back typically happens when you roll out too far and your core can't handle the demand of the stress that you're putting on it, so your low back will typically compensate by caving in. Start with your knees bent on the ground with your hands gripping the handles right underneath of your shoulders. Move your hips forward until they're aligned with your trunk. The wheel might move forward in doing this, but your arms should still be roughly underneath of your shoulders. Once you're in alignment, then begin to move your arms forward, keeping your core braced and squeezing your glutes throughout the movement. Roll out as far as you can without compensation of the lower back before pulling the wheel back in, reversing the movement. Ideally, rolling the wheel back in looks like the rewinded version of rolling the wheel out. 